the Philippines has six helicopters on order under a $269 million government-to-government -government contract with Turkey that was signed in July 2020. The acquisition program is part of the Horizon 2 phase of the Philippines' military modernization plan. The helicopters are manufactured by Turkish Aerospace Industries and is based on the Agusta Westland A129 Mangusta design. The new helos will be assigned to the Philippine Air Force's 15th Strike Wing. T-129 ATAK is a twin-engine, tandem-seat, multi-role, all-weather attack helicopter based on the Agusta A129 Mangusta platform. The T-129 was developed by Turkish Aerospace Industries, TAI, in partnership with Leonardo, Agusta Westland Helicopters. The helicopter is designed for armed reconnaissance and attack missions in hot and high environments and rough geography in both day and night conditions. The T-129 is the result of the integration of Turkish-developed avionics, airframe modifications, and weapon systems onto the Agusta Westland A129 airframe, with upgraded engines, transmission and rotor blades. The helicopter has a unit cost of roughly US $50 million. The ATAK can be used in the anti-armor, armed reconnaissance, ground attack, escort, asymmetrical, fire support and short-range anti-aircraft roles. The T-129 ATAK is equipped with a 20mm three-barrel rotary cannon in a nose turret with 500 rounds of ammunition. It can also be equipped with up to 8 UMTAS 160mm long-range anti-tank missiles, 76 unguided 70mm rockets for close air support, 16 CIRIT 70mm missiles and 8 air-launched Stinger short-range air-to-air missiles. The helicopter features also include high maneuverability, low visibility, sound and radar silhouette, high impact resistance and ballistic tolerance.